Okay. Guys, it says departure. It's time to leave Jamaica. Time to leave Jamaica. 74. Okay. 69, 74. Six. Guys, I've arrived in this airport uh, in Montego Bay. It's time for me to leave Jamaica, guys. Looks really beautiful. I love the check-in. I see where my gate is at. Okay. I don't know if it's this side or... Let me figure out this. So guys, they say gates. Uh, this, is, this airport is really different. Actually, on the screens, they write the they write the number so mine is like 64 so it should be this one's right here let me go i have not checked in so it will be nice for me to just check in okay i think it's right here where these guys are actually 69 yeah it's right here let me wait and right there I check in. Time to go to United States of America. Guys, I was the first guy to arrive at this check-in. See, it's empty here. I go there, they just told me the counter opens at six. So I have at least 50 minutes to wait. Yeah, the flight leaves around eight something. So let me just wait. I tried checking in online but they were saying passport number and it didn't allow letters like A, B, C, D. My passport starts with letters. So, so that's why I'm here. Guys, I just received my ticket. Time to officially say goodbye to Jamaica. I have to go through immigration and first I want to go to security. So they said I have to go front and upstairs, get one, get, go to security, then, you know, immigration, let's see. I don't even know actually how many days they gave me, I'll check that one. Guys, just went through security, time to hit the road. We're gonna, to, we're gonna go through Montego Bay. Beauty free, beauty free Montego Bay. First time in this airport. Let me take a picture of this. Beauty free. Okay. Hey. One of the best parts of airports is actually walking through duty free. They're always so clean and so nice. Like you just wanna spend your money like a friend of mine I'm seeing here. So yes, really beautiful. Let's go. My friend, you got this. One. I think it's, this guy is his first time flying. Honestly actually, it's in US dollars. I don't have dollars, I have Jamaican dollars actually. Guys, look at this beautiful car in Jamaica, in the airport right now. Look at this, goodbye Jamaica. Wow, bro, what a beautiful place to be. Rastafarian flags everywhere. Look at the sun. Time to leave. So... Let's go, bro. Let's go, let's go, let's go. What a grand. And I say thank you, Jamaica, for actually always supporting me and also for the new followers that just joined. Uh, get along with me because I do this around the world. Let's go.
I'm just getting lost. This airport looked small, but now I'm convinced it's big actually. Look the outside. Goodbye, Jamaica. Goodbye. Remember to have your boarding pass and your passport. All set ready available for inspection at the gate. Time to leave. Make your way to gate number two for boarding. Oh my boy. Boarding. I need to check even which seat number. I saw it was an A. I asked actually the lady to give me a window seat. And uh, let me see which number they gave me. I'm zone two. Most of the time I'm zone three. Oh, seat three A. Wow, that's like that feels like first class, bro. Good morning, everyone. Time to say goodbye to Jamaica. Let's go. Time to leave. Spirit of Jamaica. Good morning. Hey, good morning, my brother. Hello, good morning. I am actually 3A. Okay, let's go somewhere here. All right, let's see right here. Right here, that's where we are. 3A. So I have to live there. It's actually this side. I'm stretching myself out. Let's go. Seated with seatbelts fastened and all carry on items, including laptops, should remain stowed. Please silence cell phones and other portable devices and ensure they're switched to game or airplane mode. Flight attendants, prepare doors for departure. Cross check and standby for all calls. hits the road actually the air first time flying with this airline it's called frontier what a guan time to leave jamaica guys i'm wearing this it was actually very cold and it's the closest jacket i could grab so i grabbed it but i know once i land in miami it's gonna be hot so let's go let's go Just living, guys. Beautiful Jamaica. This marks the end of a beautiful series of Jamaica. Can you hear me? -da 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 -da. I don't know if that brother can see me waving, man. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll be dimming the cabin lighting for takeoff. There are reading lights located above your seat for additional lighting. Light is technically empty, guys. Look at that. Like ten seats. I'm the only one sitting there. And like one, two, three, four, five, six. Wow. I, 
I will sleep later. But the flight is so short, it's just one hour. It's a guy building a really nice villa up there. Jamaica. I'm right here. the water right there bro the Caribbean wow look at that oh the Z looks Jamaican just left bro Hey man, to be honest, I'm so so blessed and I thank God every single day, bro. When I say bro, I mean everybody. <laughs> I use that word just to say, I don't know, it's something I like to use. We are already in the sky. I think we are turning around. Can you see that? Oh my god, I wanna capture this a little bit. Look at that guys. Wow. We up in the skies guys. Up in the skies. Otaguan, Otaguan commandos. We are landing in Miami. More than excited, guys. More than just excited. Look at that, man. Slow but sure. Otaguan. What a beautiful day. Look at the clouds right here.
houses. All of them. down in Miami, Florida. It's not my first time in this airport. I've used it before. So it's just a reminder. It's a lazy girl, actually a guy. He's been standing now, he's sitting down. I think sometimes, man, you work until you feel... Actually, that's not being lazy. It's just feeling tired, bro. Sometimes you want to rest your body. Wow, we were so close with this Suriname. Okay. Just touched ground. F7. Gonna operate it. Flight attendants, prepare doors for arrival. Cross check, standby for all calls. There's a lady over there operating it. really big so we're gonna catch one small train and I think at that building over there that's where immigration and passport control is there and route to Africa so stay tuned and follow my journey through guys because at the end of this month I'll be in Africa bro huge airports this is amazing this guy 
doesn't have luggage or anything, I guess. It's very steep here. I don't know how they designed it that way. It's when you are landing. Oh, I've been to Guadalajara, Havana, Montego Bay, yes. Okay, I'll put my camera down, guys. I go through passport control. So I'm saying guys, I just went through immigration, welcome to Miami, and the lady who checked me in, she was one of the best immigration officers I've ever met. Somehow I tend to like ladies, they are more social, they talk, they try to understand where you're coming from, who you are, in a good way. And now I'm supposed to meet my friend here who has been waiting at least for more than Two and a half hours or three. How oh, is my friend John? Stephen. I think he's calling me. Hey bro. Hey, what's happening? Is he out? Yeah, I'm out now. Alright, I'm I charging the car. So, okay. so give me about five to six minutes. Okay, so I wait you outside where the cars are passing by, right? I'll tell you the gate number. Yeah, just do you know the, the gate number? Okay, let me just tell you right now because I'm I'm actually walking to the door, like getting out. Okay, so you get a door number, just text me, and I'm on my way right now. I think it's D, D, I've seen it, like D. It's D, D for dog. It's also a number. Okay. Okay. Okay, number seven. Oh, I see. Number seven. Yeah, number seven. Yeah. All right. Seven D. Okay, bro. Guys, I just went through immigration. Uh, one of my craziest adventures when I'm traveling these countries is to deal with immigration. And uh, today, as I cross through the immigration here, there was one lady who, you know, so it's, let me give you a scenario. So imagine these are immigration offices, small boxes, one immigration officer, another one there, another one here, another one there. Then there's this one lady who spoke, who asked people questions you can hear from the other side, like sitting down. Let's say you're seated there, you can hear, you can hear her asking questions. She, her vibe was so good and I was saying I wish this lady calls me I need to talk with her like just the conversation and sure enough she actually called me and the vibe was something else so this is the funny thing they have all my information in the system they know how many countries I've been to man she asked me so you've been to over 70 countries I'm like boom how did you just know that but that's America, so welcome to Miami. That's Miami. God damn. So I'm waiting for my friend here. Then we're gonna hit the road. And it's hot already, the way I'm feeling it. I wanna take a picture with this car here. Maybe this will be a good start. It doesn't look so nice, because I don't like things to deal with police. But at the same time, they keep us safe. So it's something also to celebrate. So I'm waiting for my friend here. You're gonna be coming. Uh, actually, I'm supposed to stay in Miami, but I'm going to stay at his place for a day or two, then come back to Miami. Now, I realized something. Um, Okay, maybe I, I should not I should not say this. This is more personal. I should keep it private. Anyway, welcome to Miami guys. And it's time for us to meet my friend who has actually been one of my subscribers, guys. He's been here for the longest time. He's one of those guys who actually supports me 
with a donation here and there and I'm waiting for him he sent me a picture of his car before so let me actually go back and see the picture of his car and see one minute okay so the car should look like this I think I should be there oh this is taxi okay so taxi and uber so the car should come here I told him 7D 7 number 7 and D let me put some light for you guys a little exposure 7D 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 I think he could be not that guy for sure but the car looks like it you know so let's see Thank God we have uh, internet at the airport because sometimes we would arrive in a place I need to take dollars but I don't know I still have a thousand dollars with me here cash so let me wait for my friend this guy looks like one of my friends but he's not the one but again we're in Miami you know hey people pulling over American dream Why is this guy standing here? He's blocking people. Oh, he's waiting for his big dog. Yeah, the immigration lady was like, like we talked and she was like so happy. She says, that's my dog, you know? I'm like, bro, <laughs> I swear it's because there are cameras. I would have asked her for her number. I swear before God, she's so good, bro. Like the vibe. And I like people who talk loud. I don't know why. I tend to like them. Like, I feel like they have nothing to hide, you know? Than people who say, you know, hey. Okay, let's wait for my friend. Welcome to Mayan. Thank you, bro. Thank you, Stefan, man. You know, probably. Hey, how are you, my brother? I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Good, man. Good to meet you, man. Good to meet you, too. We go in? Okay. Oh, how do you open this, bro? Look at this door. Oh, <laughs> I've never seen a handle like this before. A handle? A handle, like uh, when you open the, the door. Yeah, oh, the it's, handle. It's like, it's like a stick. Yeah, yeah. Let me hold the camera. It's America, guys. America. Uh, you know, one thing when I arrive in this country, the first thing I notice mm -hmm. is everybody drives and big roads because you don't see this in most countries that's true you go to let's say even kenya or jamaica where i just came from mm -hmm. people are walking in the streets and just a few driving and and mostly people co taking collectivo you know yeah 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 and you come here it's another level of, of living wow look at that america been to Florida before. Yeah, I've been before, but yeah. uh, I stayed, I enjoyed it. But you know, again, coming back, you want to see how things have changed, you know? Oh, yeah, things have and, changed. Yeah, and guys, we're here. I'm with my brother, Stefan. He just picks me from the airport. You know, man, it's a blessing to have people like you. Like, you go to a new place and you have somebody, man, picking you up. You know, other places you arrive, you start looking for Uber. <laughs> you realize the app is not functioning, you That's know? True. And you start trying lift you realize lift was banned two years ago Let's so go okay here. all right and we will find some place to some place all right oh, this no that's not kid it looks jamaican looks really jamaican all right so you can you can have this juice here for you, you know? oh man guys i'm with stefan and he brought juice because he knows maro likes some juice <laughs> thank you so much man thank you so much 
and now his car is really surprising me you know america is full of surprises mm -hmm. and and look look like you put your phone here just like that uh, it's already charging you see that just replacing it here and even driving the car man you showed me two buttons and you're on yeah park park so right now it's parking park. i hit the button mm -hmm. And I just put my foot on the gas yeah. and hit drive. Yeah. And we off. No manual gears, nothing. Nothing. Oh my god. This I'm... this vehicle has three modes. Uh-huh. E economy. Okay. Normal. Okay. And sport. Oh. Look what I have. Look, look over here. Yeah. This is economy. Okay, that one's economy. See, it's normal now. Okay. And when it's turned to sport, yeah. look what happens. Everything turns red. Because it's ready to go. Ready to go. Look at that. Damn. What's the name of this car? It's a Hyundai yeah. EV6. EV6. Look at these guys. Electric vehicle. Yeah. Six version. Guys, we're in America. This is a GT line. Not anymore Montego Bay. We are here in Miami. <sighs> it's long since I've been here. You know, actually, the last time I've been here is... I'd at least I think two years at mm -hmm. least two years and I had fun the last time I was here man let me see this time Miami is fun yeah Miami is fun maybe you can introduce yourself to the audience maybe people don't know you man so at least people can connect with you and also check here in the link here's a YouTube channel we're gonna get it a thousand subscribers in less than one day when this video go out yes, yes guys my name is Stefan. Yes. I'm from, I am Stefan. Yes. I was born and raised in Anguilla. Yes. In Anguilla. Anguilla. How, how do you pronounce Anguilla. it? Anguilla. 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 Oh, Anguilla. Anguilla. Like, Anguilla. Yeah. Okay. And um, been living in Miami. Yeah. Not Miami, Florida. Yeah. For probably 19 years. 19 years. But, yeah. With hopes to move back to Anguilla oh. and um, start up my new little business there yeah but um, right now before I had a uh, several YouTube channels oh. um, for meditation sleeping okay. and stuff like that but wow. I decided you know what? Yeah. my last one I rebranded it yeah I used to have videos like yeah. how to uh, help your diabetes yeah uh, how to grow your hair longer yeah 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 and yeah. I just rebranded it to a yeah. travel channel wow. and I have so much content right now is yeah. just my timing yeah i don't have the time to do it but i will make the effort and yeah. definitely start thank you today. man how do you see maro inspiring you in terms of creating content tra uh, like travel content actually man i can't i can't even start to begin yeah yeah because yeah. you've been to over 70 countries i've been yeah. to 34 35 man that's great you know somebody having a regular job to do that because for me, this is like what I do for a living. Mm -hmm. But you like saying, you know, I'm, 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 next week I'm going somewhere. For 34, for 34 countries, it's not a joke, bro. 34 countries. Actually, it's like, actually, if you put that together, it's like years of traveling, you know? Yeah, yeah. You know? But yeah. you, you have inspired me so much, man, because, you know, I was telling my sister the other day, yeah. when I first saw you, yeah. <laughs> you was in Colombia and you was missing a front tooth. Yeah, yeah, guys. And I'm like, man. I, yeah, man, yeah, man, yeah, go ahead. yeah. Guys, sorry to cut him short. You know, I miss one of the of my teeth. That's for sure. Yeah. <laughs> and I was like, man, this guy missing a front tooth and he, he don't care. <laughs> he he had the mentality. He's gonna win yeah. regardless. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. Like, I swear before God, bro. I'm like, you know, even. Ah, so, I've been ah, following you ever yeah. since then. Man, those I'm, are like my first, first videos. Yeah, yeah. And um, when when you started, your your Spanish was horrible. Yeah, 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 and yeah, I'm yeah. Like, no. Yeah, man, smooth. You speak fluent. Yeah, man. You know, it's. I'm grateful. I'm so grateful to God. I'm gonna give you a little pull. Okay. Don't scream. Okay. Don't scream. <laughs> Let me check my safety belt. <laughs> Don't scream. I want. I want to get a little distance away from. The oh, vehicle. from the car because it's but gonna pull. It will, it will get there really quick. Okay. Yeah, it will get there really quick. How far can this vehicle go without charge? Like how many miles? Actually, in America, they use miles, not kilometer. Okay. Right now, it's in. Um, sport mode. So yeah. It's only 142 miles now. Wow. But if, if I want to take it off, yeah. the economy, it's already 150. Right. And it's going to go up higher. Oh. 
but like yeah. I said, it gives you electricity yeah. depending on your sport. Okay. So, so I, fully charged, it can go at least how many miles? At 270. Wow. And um, wow. basically, that's the same thing a regular car will do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, to charge this from, say, up to 80%, it's going to cost you $14. $14. If you was to go to the gas, the gas station, it's going to cost you $50. Whoa, I see. I see. Whoa. I already feel it, bro. You know, I feel it already, man. Man, it's like it's gonna, it's gonna like fly up. You know, you feel, you feel that feeling. Guys, you're testing the car here. I wish you were in my seat to feel what you're feeling. And when you turn up, make the turn signal. See here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You have the, the camera. It shows, shows you everything. It shows you. And if a car is there, it would prevent me from hitting that car. Oh, automatically, it will detect it. Right. Guys, that's Miami for you. We are outside and I'm with my brother here, Stephen. He came, he came to pick me up at the airport, man. It feels really good. Miami, La Vida Loca. Let's see. Yeah, it gets really expensive down here. That's all I know. Like it doesn't play. And that's actually one thing that scares me about America, you know? Mm -hmm. You just came where you're paying like uh, Airbnb $40 and here they're telling you like 100, you're like, bro. That's cheap. Hundred dollars is still cheap. Yeah, I imagine. Yeah. On average, people I charge you like how much? Two fifty. Two fifty. Three hundred. Down. It depends on the the, um, the, hip, the hotel. Oh. Some of these can be five hundred dollars. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Five hundred a night. Oh yeah. <laughs> Bro, my YouTube money is finished in Miami before even I arrive in Africa. <laughs> 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 Uh, oh TV yeah, again. I see, I see oh, right no. there. Fully Volvo. The world is going EV, man. People are building more in Miami, right? Yeah, yeah. South Beach. This is toward South Beach, right? Uh, South Beach is no, the other direction. Oh, okay. Because my friend, who I will stay with after, mm -hmm. he lives in South Beach. He calls himself Sobe. Sobe. Like the king of South Beach. Gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, he's also a very good friend. I met him in Colombia and then we became friends. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, in the streets in Colombia he identified me. Then we became really good friends. But man, are you coming for the party or no? I have to. Come, bro. I swear, come. I have to, man. Come even see this Africa. I have You've to. You've been to Africa before? Yeah. I, I have a piece of land in Burundi. Yeah, you told me that. Yeah. Like Burundi. Yeah. Come, come. Because yeah. I was like, you know, they say Burundi is the poorest country in the world. I'm like, you, you know what? I want to live in the poorest country. Yeah, 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 yeah. I have a friend, you know, a Burundian travel. I don't know if you know the guy. Yeah, yeah. I saw him. Yeah, he's from Burundi. So yeah. at least you have a contact, man. Wow. What pushed you to go to Burundi, bro? Like, who connected you until you bought land? That's I, crazy. I, I was speaking to... Yeah. I can't call her name. Yeah. But, um... Are you recording? Yeah, I'm recording. Okay. Actually. Yeah. I can't call her name. But... Yeah. I went there with her. Yeah. Um, she lived in, in Canada. Yeah. You and, went to Burundi before? Yeah. Ah, you're a real G, bro. Yeah. Then you know Africa. So... Yeah. Uh -huh. She, um... She introduced me to it and I'm like... I said, this is the poorest country in the world. I've been places in America yeah. that was just as poor. Yeah. So I I love it. The food, everything was fresh. Imagine and, uh, countries like that if you really invest well, bro. And the people you treat you really, really well. good. That's that's Africa actually. And they respect you. Yeah. So you're hearing something in the back there, that's my jug of water. Oh, ice. okay. So, I love your lifestyle, man. It's purely Miami, <laughs> you know, shorts, so, and, you know. <laughs> uh huh. So, but um, that's how you get you 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 bought land there. Life li life is too short, man. Yeah. Life is way way too short. Yeah. So, you gotta live it for today, but plan for tomorrow. 
guys we in Miami yeah we just left Jamaica if you're watching this Jamaica officially goodbye <laughs> and I'm with my brother Yasef and he has been supporting me guys I said I have to see him before I go to Africa That's love, man. and also my American visa is, up, is ending so I really wanted to see him and meet my other friend here then you know actually I, my flight is from New York mm -hmm. but I, I will I will transit as I go home you know like I'll take my flight here I arrive there midnight and the following day I keep moving wow. it's gonna be a tough tough travel but I'm yeah. down for it guys imagine he's telling me about my Yugno he's so surprised man what do you think about like uh, my Yugno for example what does actually like that tell you like with life you know generally you just gotta stay persistent yeah and you know he was appreciative of you yeah. giving him the opportunity yeah not just to work on your house yeah but to help him with English to help man. him with his, with his channel man and he just blossom man. man I hate to say blossom because yeah. he's a man yeah yeah but yeah he just flourished yeah hundred you know? percent he man. flourished and his, you know. his new song yeah <laughs> love it uh, i'll be meeting him in less than a week from now probably yeah, no a week let's say 10 days from now because mm -hmm. I'll, I'll be in the u.s for at least a week or so yeah let's see how it goes so which part are we right now of miami um brickle brickle yeah this is brickle right now man these guys have trees here it feels like i'm in jamaica you know these are very very old trees and this is a very expensive neighborhood oh. so hotels in this neighborhood yeah i see actually can probably be five six hundred or more a night a night oh my god a night and there's there's some hotels on south beach that yeah. can run you a thousand dollars what easily so how much do people like pay here rent you know like just rent Who's um, up? Mostly high rises in yeah, this I area. I see the name here, sorry. Bro Brooklyn. Brooklyn Place. Yeah. Mostly these is high rises and yeah. your rent is gonna be five thousand, six thousand or more. Oh my god. A month. A month, yes. And that's before you pay insurance, you pay and all these things. Building. The one in front of us? Yeah, it's like Kavi. Let me capture it with my Instagram here also. Guys, we're in Miami. What can we say, man? It's just blessing of a blessing. It's cool here. I've realized the power of planting trees and just having trees everywhere. Absolutely. Like it gives you a huge, beautiful ambience. Like you feel like, wow, there's even a church here. Wow. Hotels can go for 600. I, I can show you on the phone. Yeah, yeah okay. Very it's, expensive. Wow. Very then expensive. I want to go to a hostel, bro. I don't want to break your back. <laughs> <laughs> I swear. Don't worry about that, man. Uh, you know, I'm a hostel guy. You know, me, me, I tend to tell myself I can survive. You know? Look at this, guys. Miami. All country. Look at the glass. Yeah. You know, nowadays, actually, people have changed the way of building. It's metal and glass. Metal glass. Like, like, look at your house. Yeah. I've really tried, man. Your, your house, you know, I have the steel one I yeah. did from your house. Yeah. It's the steps. Oh, yeah, the floating one. I got the steel on steps, oh, man. Oh, well, you good on these friends. But you know what you can do? Is you can, you can be my neighbor, man, if you want. You can have a house in Kenya. I can find you land. That one. The thing is, with yeah. that right now, yeah. my parents are getting older. Yeah. And, um, I, I kind of you want to be around them I want to be closer okay yeah I, I have to be closer to make sure that they're fine okay so to have to travel from Africa yeah to Anguilla yeah it, it's gonna take me basically two days and if I if I need you to see home, from Kenya to New York mm -hmm. uh, let's say Nairobi yeah it's uh, 12 hours right. and a half right so let's say a day 24 hours Okay. If you if if we go actually like worst case scenario, yeah. Because from New York to Angola, how how long does it take? About four and a half hours. So yeah, that's sixteen hours if we combine all. Let's say worst case scenario. Mm, well, actually, a day. They, you would have to go from uh, New York to Saint Martin. Oh Saint yeah, Martin. And, I, and you can just catch a twenty-minute boat ride over to Angola. Oh. Uh, from New York. Yeah. To Miami. 
Yeah. And then from Miami to Angola is like two hours and 45 minutes. Wait, this is Argentinian embassy here, right? Yeah, for sure. Or it's a hotel. You know, in America, like all buildings look great. Mm -hmm. It's not like any other place that you find a good building is where the embassy is. And flags, it's a common thing here. People can actually put flags just because they love that country, you know, yeah. or they're from that country. So it's you can't tell if it's a hotel, if it's an embassy, if Only it's somebody's is, house. The restaurant is here. Bro, I what? just don't know. Yeah, bro, you brought where? me to the most expensive restaurant, my brother. I just don't know where the parking is. I thought you were gonna go to a hood, bro. Hey, Miami, Miami. I, I see people man moving at least for the first time i'm seeing people walking in the street yeah because this is a city okay generally um i guess they call it a cosmopolitan yeah cosmopolitan um, they would normally walk okay all uh, right smart bikes and stuff like that yeah but there's no parking and parking can run 50 dollars a day in these cities i remember visiting a friend of mine in new york mm -hmm. to he lives in a building and to park under that building is $600. Where he, he lives, he can't even park where he lives. So he has to dodge and see what time, you know, those hours. That's terrible. Yeah, man, I felt bad for him. 600 a month. Just for parking. Huh? Just for parking. In a building where you live, New York. That's, that's terrible. Yeah. That's terrible. Guys, you see the lights in the EV? So you're gonna find some parking here. Man, it's really good. Even just to drive at night, it's like oh, encouraging. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's like everything adjusts. Wow. Yeah, we better park our car I'm here. trying to find um, visitors. Everything is valet. Oh, like even they have places for specific things. Yeah. Let's say visitors or... Reserved, damn, or maybe in the middle they don't put reserved. I don't know how much floors I can go up. Let's see, in front of us, reserved. Wow, okay, it's like everyone is reserved. Bro. Okay, this is, oh, those are reserved too. So maybe visitors is up higher. Oh, so people live inside here, right? Yeah. So that's why, and like businesses and stuff too. Oh, so they have to take these parkings. That's also reserved. Wow, it's actually written reserved everywhere. And these here, this one. Uh, okay, I. Oh. They got numbers. Oh, but so I, that don't, I don't know if it's like an apartment number. Okay. Drive. So actually, I was like, this one will make me sweat. Ah. So. Then I show you a, a view of it. Yeah. But yeah. our car is not white, right? No. But it's white to show you bright. Just, right, just to show you where you at. And um, if something was behind me, yeah, it would actually stop me. I can press gas, press gas, it and would not go. Oh. So I park perfectly right there. And all I do is hit park, uh, open the door panel. Okay. It shuts down. Oh. So automatically, once you open the door, it shuts down. Yeah, it goes in park. Oh. Eh, hey, I'll do a review of this car. Super UV, guys. You need to have rich friends. At least you can learn something. <laughs> let me actually put... Let me put this one inside here in my bag. I'll, I'll pick it up. Thank you for the juice. No problem, man. Okay. There's the least I could do. <laughs> So, I'm telling you, for instance, yeah. the doors will stay locked. Okay. Unlock, so yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I was saying. So I will know. Yeah. So when I walk up to the car. Oh, now you've locked it. Right. Okay. When I walk up to the car. Yeah. It, it will open up. That's because I was close. Okay. So as you can see. So, okay. When I walk back up to it, I don't have to do nothing. Let me put the lights. So, oh, I see it's right there. 
Let me put the lights for what for, for, to see. My camera is not so good with the... Uh... Okay, let's do this one more time. Guys, these doors here, these ones are actually automatically open and he doesn't, you see how they open like that? Have you ever seen a car open like that? <laughs> and he tells me if he walks closer to the car after locking it up, it will detect him and, and open. Yeah, you see? Okay, well, let's go. I want to put these type of tiles, these big ones. The thing is, yeah, you gotta be real careful with the big ones. Oh, because if they didn't store them correctly, they yeah, up, yeah, and they walk, yeah. When when sometimes you see this, you know, have a big lip. Oh. even though it may be flat here on yeah. the edge, yeah. So so it's good to use these small ones. Okay. Because actually, that's my next process. Probably bigger than that, maybe a three foot. Yeah, I think a 36 by 24. 6 by 24. 36, 36. 36 by 24. I think those are a better, a better choice. Man, I can't wait to see my house look like this, bro. Feel how it feels like. Man, I could look at this. You know, you can come and stay wherever, anytime you want. No and, and I'm telling you, if you come to Kenya, you may end up investing there, man. There's a lot of really opportunities, even hotels next to the beach. Yeah. Okay. One thing I didn't like about my house mm -hmm. is the quality of the, gla the not even doors. glass, it's, it's these frames. Uh, but the glass is very good. Yeah. But the, the frames, yeah. like move like, you know, weave, like when you're moving them from one direction to another. Yeah. It's kind of like you feel. <laughs> so, yeah. Maybe they were, they were supposed to give you like a thicker grid. Yeah, I, I really need like really good quality because sometimes when I travel, I feel other doors, I feel like they the are weight. Really, yeah, I want that weight. Yeah. Like it doesn't feel like, you know, but you know, aluminium is like that. Yeah. Guys, welcome to Miami. Boots on the ground <laughs> with Stefan himself here. Guys, look, we have a Tesla right here. You know, in my home, this one will be making like headlines. But here is just another car parked in the street. Wow, look at Miami, guys. You can show them the front view, like you flip the camera. Look at that, guys. And then give it the lower, this one, for a, a wider angle. You see that? So you can show up to the top. Yes, like that. Miami. Miami. We are in Miami, guys. Okay. Really good food. So, yeah, we will showcase it in a minute. Yes, guys, welcome again. I'm here with my brother. I'm helping him uh, start a YouTube channel. We are in Bole, Brooklyn. It's one of like elite spots. So let's go and see what we can have. Looks nice. Let's see what we can have here. Bole. Actually, I want to use the yeah. bathroom. It says vacant. Okay. Guys, I'm in America. That's the funny thing about traveling. Traveling? I don't even know how to lock this door. Oh, you lock it, but if you hold it, you unlock it. Okay. They don't have the male urinal part or urinary. No, urinal. Okay. Guys, we're in this nice restaurant here. What was the name again? Bole. Bole. And we're gonna have some amazing dish. I feel like actually it's here in here. This Bole. Guys, you're having food here. It's really amazing. Hey. Let me have these ones. These are like plantains. Yeah? Yeah, corn. And I just one. No, it's okay. okay. More. You want a bit more? Uh, no, it's okay. What do you want? I, I can take beans and mines. Guys, guys, it's time to eat. I just arrived in Miami. I'm with my Top dog, that's how I call him now. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, man. And what are you having? I'm having some black rice. Okay. Some teriyaki chicken. Okay. Glass noodles. Okay. With some pesto sauce. Delicious. Super. 
and I'm having salmon here, guys. I'm having, you say, how do you call this one? Sizzly? Seasoned tomatoes. Seasoned tomatoes. Yeah. Wakamole, which is technically avocado and stuff. We have this rice, they jasmine. call it jasmine rice. Jasmine rice. Jasmine rice, guys. That's jasmine rice. And I have uh, blackened corn. Yeah. How do you say? Blackened. Blackened. Yeah. Oh, wow. Like burnt. Yeah, 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 yeah. Blackened corn. I forgot the juices, man. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers, man. Long live. It's actually four different juices. Yeah, mixed together. One. This style. I'm trying this style, this style. Guys, this looks like Portugal. What is it doing here? It's picking people up. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, we finished our food, guys. Yeah, clear, clear. man. I'm finishing up this. Oriental. Yeah. That's beautiful. Guys, we just had some really amazing food. I feel full. Then I had two juices. And plus the first one. I feel really good. I feel living la vida loca. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, bro. Thank no you. No problem. So, you say there's a Korean town over here? Yeah. Oh. Oh, Mandarin. Yeah, that's like Chinese, right? Mandarin. I would, I would think so, yeah. Mandarin Oriental. Wow. We parked here. Yeah. Man, I think we it feels. Able to go to the, the ocean. Oh, yeah, the, I, I saw a spot right there actually. Let's go. Guys, we're gonna go see the ocean. Then maybe Sorry. go. I show you where we're gonna be staying. Let me actually put some light on this. I don't know. Yeah, it's doing good. Miami. Today feels cool. Yeah. Actually, I don't feel like yeah, the, the heat. Weather, the good today. Yeah. America, you see cars. It's like, there's a Jeep. There's a Tesla. This mm -hmm. is, you know? All the high-end cars. There's a Porsche in front of you. Like, it's cars, Smash. cars, cars. Yeah, yeah it's right. smashed action. But still looks nice. Yeah. I still take it. Yeah. I'm to buy. You know. I guess you're gonna have to look into an EV. There's so much <laughs> sun in, in Africa. Yeah, 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 Free yeah. Energy. Free en and um, actually, I did a 30 kilo. Guys, we came to this side here. My brother brought me to see this beautiful. Actually, the first time I'm seeing, you know, the first first time. But in this trip, is the first time I'm very close to the water. Actually, I feel like touching it. But it's a little deeper, it's not, it's not as close as you can imagine. But man, look at the yachts. People are just waiting for the weekend to party. What a beautiful day, Miami. Tall high-rise high buildings everywhere. Nowadays people build with glass and, and metal. That's the, the, the new way. The metal is really, really strong. And on yeah. top of that, they use very thick glass. Yeah, so very thick. As, as long as it's close proximity, Yeah. Uh, you can use thick glass and it's just like concrete. Imagine. But, and also most the of beauty, the windows yeah. have two pieces of glass. Joined together. Against, so that it Actually can, my house is like that also. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's 99% of the house had those two. I just don't like my frames in the house. I don't know if my contractor is watching this. I feel they are too weak a little bit. But look like that house over there. I don't know if you can see it. It's pure glass. It's pure glass. Yeah, like everything. There's no wall there, like concrete wall. And it's, this is a hurricane zone, but so can you imagine how reinforced that glass is? Oh, it has to be really reinforced because it's a hurricane zone. Yes. And you're telling me about hurricane. You told me actually it took took down a bridge over there. Yes. Not not the tall one. Yeah, the lower, the lower one. one. I see it. I and don't know if that you used can to go see. right across. Yeah. And hurricane took that out. Wow. You see that. That um, boat right there? Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. It's a very expensive boat. It looks silver. Um, it's gold actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But um, I think Tom Brady have a blue one to that, and I think. So I think it's going to that Mandarin Resort. I, I think it's going in there. Yes. Yeah. Hey, it looks luxury. Very luxurious boat. Wow. <laughs> Miami. How much does one uh, need to live here? Let's say a month, for example. It it can range. Range okay, let's say a normal one bedroom and a high rise like this. Yeah, it could run anywhere between four thousand dollars and twenty thousand dollars. Twenty thousand dollars a month, yeah, and that may be cheap too. But 
it, it's very expensive in this area. 20,000 US a month? A month. Bro, how much would you make for you to pay just rent 20,000? No, I'm not. That's or that. maybe they are, the, they are the owner of these buildings. You know, also these buildings have owners. Right, multi owners. Multi owners. Multi yeah. owners. So they may have maybe 500 apartments. Yeah. And each apartment may be owned by someone else. Wow. Um, and if you can afford it, you can buy more. But As we are, we are walking around Miami, let's go. We are seeing yards. Let's just move around as we get lost here. It's my first day. I just arrived from Jamaica. For those guys who are watching this, saying, Maro, are you still here? No, Maro just left. I want you actually to go and support my brother here. He has a YouTube channel. Yes, sir. We're going to get you a thousand subscribers for the start. Yes, sir. That one we can get sure when this video go out. But it's going to delay a little bit because I have to upload my Jamaican Absolutely. videos. Absolutely. Yeah, look at that glass, guys, from bottom to Mirrored. top mirrored glass bottom to top even this other building here oh. the one that is expensive wait well. tell me you tell me this tree right here actually i saw it where i was staying in a hostel in jamaica mm -hmm. you said this one tree could be as as, as expensive as twenty thousand dollars twenty thousand us and that may be still cheap yeah you know actually there's another brother right there you see it yes i see it and uh, everything like is symmetrical Yes. This tree has the other one right there. And these two other palm trees, they yeah, are this silver two. palm. They are called silver and palm. Those are very expensive as well. So, but you can see why they're expensive. It's showcasing the building. Yeah, even on top of that building, we have like plants. Right. Yeah. Hey, hey. Tropical. It's called tropical. Guys, tropical weather in Miami. Let's see here. But uh, I don't know, can you raise family here comfortably with this type of like lifestyle, bro? Like comfortably, you know? If, not... if, if you have the money yeah. and the means, Nothing. Yeah. you can absolutely do that. Absolutely. Because things that you can afford, most people can't really afford. Yeah. So most of these people in Miami, they have one or two parking spots. And sometimes, uh, like your friend in New York. Yeah. They also rent out. Oh, space. you can rent out the space. Yeah. So if, if you have this house as a, a summer home, yeah, a winter home, you leave New York, you, you go back to New York. Yeah. Uh, when you're not here, you rent out the apartment. Yeah. You rent out the spots. Yeah. So because they pay homeowners association. Wow. So and that could be a thousand dollars a month. Wow. It could get really expensive. So by you renting out your apartment, uh, yeah, your spaces, yeah, you just making money. Uh, that money that you're making go pay the, the utility bills, uh, Man. the homeowners association fees. Yeah. So it, it can really get tricky. You know the funny thing, you talk like a thousand is like two dollars. You know, somebody like where I'm from. Yeah. They have never been paid a thousand for the entire life and maybe they're like my mom is a teacher yeah i think the maximum she makes i think is like 700 dollars a month and she's about to retire one or two years more to retire yeah, yeah. and but here in show them how they plant trees here yeah, guys look how they plant palm trees uh -huh. so bro i was, I was asking you something before my camera went off give me one second let me ask this young lady yeah um, excuse me I have a quick question for you. Um, can we record a little bit of you two can ask you one question? Uh, yes. sure. we, we, we can, we can, we can ask okay. you off camera. <laughs> <laughs> but she can help people by answering. You, you live in this area? I do, I just moved yeah. here. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Uh, you don't have to give me specifics, but do you know generally what the rent range in this area? Oh, the rent. The rent? Yeah. yeah. It's like, expensive. Like, like say a one bedroom. <laughs> like a one bedroom. <laughs> I want to say like yeah. 4,000. Four thousand one bedroom. Like give or take, like right. some are cheaper, some oh, are more. Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right. It's so, expensive. But, <laughs> yeah, yeah. But is, is this the most expensive area down here? I'm from Palm Beach. Oh, nice. So down here, I don't know too much about down here. Yeah. But I know it's expensive. It is. Yeah. I know like different buildings are different. So like one building will be like yeah. two thousand or three thousand a month for yeah. rent. Yeah. And yeah. Then, some of these That's are like one like bedroom. Ten thousand a month. I'm oh, crazy, ten thousand. You know, um, but I just moved here, so I'm like not the <laughs> most knowledgeable. Right. No, I understand. Yeah, give us more information. Uh, yeah, you're welcome. All right, thank Take you care. so much. All right. All right. Wow. Guys, ten thousand. She just said. 
So it depends the building also. So yeah. if the building looks nice, yeah. like this here. Look at this, this tile everywhere. Yeah, it's crazy. Like, look, look even just lobby. look how... You see the lobby? Yeah. <laughs> look even here. Look, forget even that. Like, look. This is a building, guys. Maybe even we can walk this way and... and guys, look at this. This is just... Oh... America has it all. America is a great nation. But I'm telling you, bro, you have to really... Oh, it's closed here. I can't trespass. <laughs> now, that's one thing about America. It's not the way you see it. There are rules every single spot. Even me right there, somebody can say, you, why are you trespassing? Look at this. Paro. Paro. Pano. Rama. But the breeze feels good. Feels good to live here, bro. Feels soft. Look. Hey, show them the front view, man. Like, you could... Okay. Look at that, guys, where we are. Miami, Florida. I'm with my friend here. He's been supporting me so much on YouTube, guys. I decided before I go to Africa, I'll be meeting him. And it's really, 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 really amazing. And the thing is, with my, all my YouTube money, I can't still afford to live here, guys. I can't. Because it's crazily, crazily expensive. Huh. One thing I really ask myself is not to pressure myself to put myself in such an environment where I have to work so hard to just fit in. For example, the prices are so expensive and the rent just to fit in, to feel like I fit in. I really pray God I don't be that guy, you know? I don't want to kill myself trying to fit in in this crazy bubble and... But they have good amenities. Look, man. Like they provide you... Dogs. They provide you for dogs, you know? And then your trash can is right there. Trash can is right here. And you know another person can misuse it. You see another plant there? Yeah, this plant you told me it could be really expensive. I feel like if I live in Miami, I will, I will not be a YouTuber anymore. But I will become a farmer of, of plants. <laughs> I swear. You know now I'm thinking how to survive here. I'm like, bro. I will become a farmer of plants, bro. But the thing is, where will you live as you farm? You'd have to live on your farm. Maybe. Tesla. Oh, we parked over here, right? Yeah, over there. Guys, yeah. we, as we're walking by, we saw this. They have like holes here. I don't know why they do that, but it's a very good design. Looks like bricks and... Yeah. Hmm. And actually, it's in the joint where the two bricks meet. Maybe it's to help water? Yeah, maybe. Maybe if water comes this way, I don't know. Miami guys, Miami. People who speak Spanish they say Miami. And guys, we're uh, going to open the car without opening it. Yeah, just just with it in your hand. Like this? Yeah. And the doors will open. Just yes, on this side so you can see under the light. Come on this side. Oh this side because there's see light the here. Oh. Look the mirror. Look. Look look at this mirror. Look, look. It's open without me touching it. And look at the here also. I don't know if you can see, but look, it's open. See? Just, Just by here. Yeah. <laughs> uh, hey, bro, you're living La Vida Loca. And it, it welcomes you with this beautiful light. You see? LED lights all over. Ready to go. Yeah. EV cars. Yes, sir. Man, how much is this car? Sorry to ask prices, but generally, you know. 58. 58? Wow! Guys, 58,000 US. Okay. It's so, so sophisticated, my friend. Wow! It's good to have rich friends like you, man. Rich. At least I get to see, I, I get to see stuff, you know? Rich. 
I'm building myself, you know? So when you come to Africa, and that's one thing I always tell people, I have to create that if I have friends like you to come, that come, mm. you can at least fit in. Not struggle again, bro. No. Be like, you know, I was in Africa, bro, my back aches. <laughs> ah, okay, let's get out of uh, this place. So when we get lights, my camera is really bad with lighting. I'll show you more, guys. Okay. This is my brother. Uh, you're going to check his YouTube channel right here in the link. Let's get him a thousand subscribers. He welcomed me in Miami. And he only has two days here. Tomorrow is your last day, right? Yeah, tomorrow I actually yes. have yeah. a big job in um, Jupiter, Florida. Yeah. So So today is the day we are, we are actually yeah. hanging actually, out. You know, I got some water here. Yeah. Got it, some water here. Okay, let's take your time. Look at this car, guys. America. I know you drink a lot of water. Yeah, man, I love liquids. Anything liquids? Thank you. I have water here, guys. Let's go. Oh, I put this one somewhere here. Yeah, wherever you want. Okay. Have LED lighting. All right. Somebody behind me. Guys, I want to charge my phone and see what I do. So this is the car. I just put it here, like this, and look what my phone will do. Charging. Wireless. I don't have any cable. That's Nothing. crazy, bro. So, guys, big surprise from an American uh, YouTuber here. Let's see what surprises he got from me. Man, I'll take this to my village and even I'll share it. And I'll be wearing some. Man, let me see. Mara in this. Man, my Yukuno will have one. <laughs> or oh, I should take one. Because I don't want to take everything, bro. Take like, what you want. Take, honestly. Hey, guys, can you see me right there? I look so different, right? <laughs> uh huh. So, these are your clothes brand? Yeah. This is actually my clothing line. Okay. Them damn dogs. Yeah, the one you are wearing, actually. It's yeah. called. It's called. Them damn, damn dogs. dogs. Oh, from your home yeah. country. Angui Anguilla. Anguilla. Yes. So, actually, this is silent. Yes. So it's Angi Anguilla. Anguilla. I'm still happy. You won't get it. You won't get it. Yeah. Anguilla. <laughs> Anguilla. Yes. I'm coming there. Actually, I checked. We don't need visa. And you saw it when you have an American visa, you can actually yeah. visit here. Right. So, man, you want to offer me one? No, all of them. Oh, my God, man. And Come on, the, bro. They're very, very light. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and there's two different sizes because yeah. I wasn't sure yeah. which no, size I you're wear, fall in. No, I wear. Me, actually, you've seen my clothes. I wear all. Oh, and like man. I said, they're very light. Yeah, very, very, very. Because you know Marwa. So yeah, and they keep you cooler, 17 degrees than outside. Wow. And um. So I'll have to go and unpack them, man. Yeah, man. Thank you, bro. Thank you, man. I have to say thank you. And actually, he gifted me something off camera. I will not say about that. Oh. Yeah. When we reach, I'll show you the stuff in the back. Okay. So. Guys, he even bought me some cameras for my house. It's this is my water. Okay, you drink water like that. Man, it's just my first day in America. I mean, this time I've been in America many times, but very particular Miami. And my brother here, Stefan, just surprised me. Look, man, even even now, I don't even know which to take and which one to leave. I swear. Man, thank you, bro. And he's been supporting me for long. You guys have seen him. I've seen him a lot. Thank. Even when I was my house, I put lights, man. You donated. Yeah. I think how much was it? Like three hundred dollars. I don't remember. Yeah. Matter. Even me, I'm like, thank you, bro. Thank you. Guys, he has a YouTube channel. Go in the link. Look all these gifts, man. I'll share with them. People like my Yugno. I'm going to Africa, so be ready, okay? You ready? Oh, this is coming. You corner, know? corner. No, corner, cornering. Okay. Yeah, okay. Okay, white people. We are in Miami. This is it here. And it's super chill today. It doesn't feel that hot. Is summer over or is it still in the middle? No, we still, we still got Miami. Um, summer. summer. All right. Guys, I was having problems with my GoPro. 
look, my brother brought me all this. I told him actually about this because they overheat my GoPros, especially the batteries. He bought me three sets and the charger itself. Oh man, I don't even want to open them right now. They look so brand new. I just want to keep them in my bag for emergency. They're so brand new, man. Look at that. Man, what can I say, bro? Thank you, man. Exactly. Thank you, man. No problem. Thank you. Pure GoPro batteries. Let me actually take one, you see. Look, look, guys. Actually, GoPro 11. That's what I'm using, actually. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you, man. Request is connected, broken. Avoid various. Wow. Hey, this is the Marriott. I see it. Oh, oh no, we, right we were in the Marriott? No. No, no, no. It's in the, this other building. Yeah. Wow. The Marriott, Miami. Trump lives here, man. <laughs> Trump lives did, in did Miami. Did he get arrested today? Today? Yeah. He's supposed to turn himself into a <laughs> terrible. <laughs> <laughs> We are living here. I'm just seeing people of America. At least now I see some people in the street. People walk out here. America is a busy country, man. But my brother wants to move to his home country. Okay. Give it a shout out, man, so you can get people coming there. I'm Stefan with yes. um, from Actually, I'm Stefan from I am Stefan. Yes. And um, please go and follow me. Yes. Subscribe. Hit those like. Yes. Um, share those videos. A lot of content coming soon. And I'm privileged to be here with the one and only. I, I don't even have to call his name. <laughs> Not I right. don't even have to call look, his name. Look all these presents Stefan has brought me, man. Look, look. I don't know even how to say, man. Like, look. And even. Oh, man. I'm t I was telling him off camera something. Like, man, I need to pay for some, like, honestly. <laughs> oh, Stefan, man. Miami. Today it's very cool here. It's always cool like this in Miami? No, no. Normally it's really, really hot. Oh. But it's coming to the end of August. Yeah. So they're going to start to get a little cooler. Okay. So this could be the best, some of the best days also, right? Yeah, because it's not super hot, and again, it's not so. The hot. better days is around June, May okay. And June. Okay. Um, but then again, January, February, March, April, you can get some really, really cold days. Oh. Where you have to put on a jacket. Okay. So. But down here, with all the building, tall buildings. Yeah. Sometimes it can get really, really hot. somewhere here where I was told rich people really hang. Today there are no cruise ship. They're always around here. No cruise ships on the other side. Look at the villas here man. Look like that one right there. And that guy has a yacht right in front of his bed. <laughs> Look at this building right here. They are building it. It's like coming to the road. And you see? Oh they, they use concrete this one. Thin concrete. Guys, look at that White House here. We are in Miami. Homes here. It's a beautiful place, man. One thing I love about America is the way they organize their stuff. Yeah, yeah. The trees, it's always like cutting grass, the fences are cut. Groomed. Yeah, it's very well groomed. And people respect trees. Like you may not just wake up and see somebody cutting this tree. Look on the side, how much, how much trash you see? Nothing, my friend. Nothing. Nothing. You see actually trash cans. And even the fences are well done. It's already rolling. So there's a statue somewhere here. It could be wrong. It could be in the um. I know there used to be one. A big sculpture. Okay. 
like like a hand. But look at those two Teslas, one behind each other over there. <laughs> and look even at the villa. You see the glass? Mm -hmm. That's the future, man. Electric. Electric, right? But you should make a video if yeah. you want to use this car yeah. showing the beauty of electricity and you yeah. can also talk about Niger. You know, just correlate oh, both yeah. together because man, if if you can run a, a car yeah. every day all day, yeah, and um you can't run a country, yeah. When I mean, you can run a car. You know, actually like personally I'm into the electronic stuff, but there's a better way of doing it. Not like let's do it because we want but we don't care where we are getting this resource from no. you know because those are also people they have kids they want a good nobody wants a bad life hey, these are Rolls Royce yeah Rolls Royce truck wow some food guys we're in Hilton bro I can't believe Maro today will sleep in Hilton <laughs> <laughs> Got to sit to this brother here, man, Stephen, bro. You know, people ask me why I'm building a big house. I'm like, bro, I have millionaire friends now. I'll be saying that. Leave me alone, bro. Like, I'll be like, leave me alone. I have millionaire friends, man. I have, I have to create space for them. So, okay. I have to turn off the camera. Being behind. Okay, guys, big surprise. Oh, did we park a wrong place? Oh man, they're actually big stuff. It's a whole... Yeah. It's just the packaging is kind of big. But if they're small. We can open them. Okay. Then let me talk to this guy. Yeah, let's let's check in then we see. That, guys, these are cameras for my... These are cameras for my... For my house. Guys, Stephen bought me a lot of things. Mm, I don't even know what to say, bro. It's my first day here in Miami. Pff, man, look, he bought me batteries, clothes, cameras. He's getting me a place to stay here in Hilton. I'm like, bro, man, why? But again, I have to accept when God blesses you. And also when God brings people for uh, for you, you have to take it in a good way, you know? I want to say thank you so much. We're in Miami. Girls here are kind of walking like that. I don't know if you can see on the other side. Let me take you along. Mm -hmm. Miami is like that. But anyway, we are in America, so... I don't even know what to say. For me... I'm excited, but I've been in America. I love being here. I don't even know what to say, man. I don't want to say that. Let me just actually thank my brother here for actually surprising me with amazing gifts. Guys, can we go and flood his YouTube channel? Like, He bought me cameras, guys. Do you see them? I'll be showing you. Grab my phone. All right. He picked me from the airport, he drove me here, we've gone for lunch, he's taking me to buy some fruits over... <sighs> Man. But thank God, he's, he's coming to Africa, so also I'll do my best to appreciate him. And people keep asking me, Mara, are you building a big house? Bro, I have, I, have, I have rich friends, man. I have to build something if they come home, they feel happy and they can chill and my mama maybe can cook or I'll find somebody cooking for them even me I can cook for them you know some goat meat and something if you don't eat goats we have vegetarian food what an amazing day bro a lot of surprises I can't even carry look from clothes from hearts look how many this is one two three uh, wait four five six seven and even look eight shirts t-shirts all these 
batteries not even one cameras in the back and even give me i won't even say this this is too much bro okay hope you're doing good guys uh my brother got me a stay you can see i have the key with me right here hilton and he tells me he can't have me Publix stay there restaurant without me having some food <laughs> Man. please say the line number but, but you eat meat you as would a you person? like guidance to this location please say the line number oh you got it would you like guidance to this location yeah i do eat meat but very little because um, i was thinking when you arrive in my village mm -hmm. before even saying hello to you I welcome you with the goat slot. <laughs> I swear, you know. Before even saying hello, <laughs> bring the and, goat. Yeah, and like you invite, you should arrive even before the party. You know, I don't want like when everybody say, "Maro, Maro, can I take a picture?" I want you to be there before, no so you can enjoy the goat soup. You know, my mom <laughs> loves goat soup because when you are sick in Africa, yeah. they prepare you goat soup to heal you. It's just something like so nice for the body, so they. Or even maybe they also sometimes yeah, eat like for the gold. old people. I like gold. And you know the one from the village, they eat like grass. Yeah. Okay, guys. Today I'll sleep in Hilton, Miami. Honestly, I never imagined. Yeah. But I'm really grateful, my brother, man. Like a million times. Ain't no problem. You know, sometimes words can't express how much. You know how I feel inside? Can I explain this? I feel like a little shy, you know? <laughs> Casablanca. Yeah, I feel a little shy and I'm like, man, he did too much for me. Too much already. Uh, it's you know? This Miami, it's getting dark. I don't know what time is it. Six oh, minutes. It's, oh, wow. Wow. So I'm just well, going to it's sleep. Some rain gonna come through. Yeah. Guys, I'm back to American stores. Uh, my brother said I can't go to Hilton with no food <laughs> so we're gonna cut, get some fruits here yeah. and flowers I'm gonna find you a fruit that you never had before okay you want that? yeah I see them here uh, fruits over okay. I think it's called a, a plum cut plum plum cut plum cut plum and an apricot mixed together wow I was eating plums in in, in uh, Jamaica. No, that's a June plum. June plum, yeah. Yeah, those, those are good. You want grape? Yeah, I don't mind, I swear. Like, <laughs> you know, also the thing is, man, you've done a lot that I don't uh, like tell you what I want, what I don't want. <laughs> oh, I don't know if you understand that. Uh, guys, I'm a little shameful, you know, like honestly, you know, and. Oh, man. These are delicious. Okay. Is... You want more? Okay. Okay. Um, your orange, you want avocado? No, I uh, I think uh, like maybe banana if there's banana yeah, because right. banana gives you energy. Pick up whichever one you want. So I want the ones that look more ripe. Uh, yeah, that's okay. Yeah, that's okay. And nectarine? Yeah, we can have. Uh, okay. Says in session now. See how much they sell them. This is a different fruit. This is an aprium. Okay. There's, there's two different fruits. Okay. I've had this one, but I've never had that one. Okay. So you can have one of those too. Another one? Yeah. This two. These are two, two different fruits. This is a, a plum cut. Okay. And there's an aprium. Okay. And as you say. <laughs> What can I say? Because I've never tried them. I'll I'll try to see this. As a matter of fact, I'm yeah. gonna try one of these two. Okay. We I... can share if you want. No, no, no. no. Okay. Uh. Keep up with your own, you want. So let me just let me just take uh, two. Also, I think like because you're going home, I we could also do some foods for you. No, Are you okay? No. Okay, two is okay. And I'm one. I think tomorrow I'll go to my friend's place with this shopping. <laughs> <laughs> you want something to drink? Gatorade? Or... Yeah, let's see maybe yeah, if... Uh... Have you ever tried kombucha? Uh, let's, let's see it, let's see it. Kombucha, it's called kombucha? Yeah. 
Okay, that's like American stuff. No. It's oh, I can I can have uh, one of these. I actually like watermelon. Let me have this. Maybe even this will be my dinner. I swear I'll take this to my friend that I'm going to stay tomorrow. This is perfect for me. Uh, I th I, even one man can't finish that, man. <laughs> Kombucha, that's what I'm looking for now. Oh, naked. I really love that fruit, actually. But it's very expensive. Look, $4. These are two. These give you um, a boost of energy. And this, this is... um. Kombucha. Yeah, this is really, really, really good. All it right. boosts your immune system too. Okay, I'll have that one. You, you wanna buy one for yourself? You're gonna like that one. Yeah. Okay. Kombucha. Yeah. You're gonna like that one. For real, for real. I think that's great, man. All right. Yeah. I really love this naked. Maybe I'll, I'll add. I'm sorry, man. To, to me. I love this naked stuff. It's very good. This is enough, and I'm telling you, 70% of this. I'll be carrying to my friend tomorrow. That's alright. At least, <laughs> at least you have it. So, yeah, that's true, man. Thank you. Huge supermarkets in Miami. That this thing is four, four dollars mm -hmm. and uh, and forty-five cents. So can you imagine when bricks go into effect? When bricks go to effect, <laughs> <laughs> you'll be in Angula, man. You'll that could be, be fifty-five dollars times four. It's Guys, that this thing is 400, you know, like 4.45, this, 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 green stuff that you can take Skuma Week in my village and grind it and sell it for four dollars and four. Look how this dog is displayed. Ah, this is crazy. Let's, I'll tell you how much everything costs, guys. Oh, okay. oh, when they reach there, they automatically stop. Yes. Okay. And we put this thing. Kombucha. That thing. Yeah. Tap that. Mm -hmm. Give me good right here. Oh, you just tapped already? Even yeah. before you finished yeah. to, to pay? Okay, guys, I'm gonna tell you how much it is. <laughs> it is 33. 30, 33. Thank you, bro. Let me help you. You know, to be honest, you've sorted me for three days. Uh, three days. No, I'm just saying. You've sorted me. Three days breakfast, man. You know, I don't eat that much, but. Oh, with, with kombucha and that drink I bought, but I love I love See fruit. The card? Yeah. Oh, you put it and it goes on its mm -hmm. own. Oh, so that is purely for the card. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, have you ever seen this? Look at the wind outside. That's the wind. Oh, 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 it feels like hurricane is coming, bro. I don't film this. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I don't know where my friend went. Yeah. Wait, that's the wind outside? Thank God we packed, we packed indoor. And this is all packing. Whoa, the weather just changed in a minute. Wow. How big the cameras are? It, it's a it's a, a pattern inside here. Okay. Where's my keys? It's a pattern just to protect it. Okay. Wow. Okay. Oh 
it's actually very small like it's the box that makes it look big yeah okay so, so this here is basically what you do to put it up in there okay the screws i can put this one in my bag the way it is it's, it feels like it can fit so basically that's what it is okay yeah i see so uh oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Screwdriver. Yeah. This is for my pool. Okay. To get chlorine from my pool. Okay. So it, it's not it's not that big as you think. But yeah. like I said, you can still throw your clothes. Yeah. Whatever yeah. excess clothes you have. Yeah. You can throw them in here. Yeah, I'll, yeah, yeah. I'll pack them. I'll yeah. wash them, pack them. Yeah. I'll ship them for you. Wow. So I think that's what you're gonna do. So let me bring the bag. And I'm gonna leave this. So what I'll do. Yeah. Put here, I think there is. I don't know if there are two, they're all for the camera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, nothing else is in there. Yeah, so, so let me bring my bag and we get the clothes. Yeah, open up another one. I use this. To oh, okay, let's put it here, guys. These are security cameras for my, for my house, and that's what I'm buying right now. Actually, he bought them for me. Top security. They're called Ring. It's Thunder. It's called. It's, that's, that's Thunder. Thunder. Outside. Yeah. yeah. Look. At, hey, it's raining like crazy. Okay. Yeah. 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 I'll carry these ones. In, in my bag I'll really take care of it slowly you know so they can arrive in Africa yeah we can install these instant and like I said yeah wherever you go in the world so these ones they use they use solar or they use uh, no, the electricity electricity right okay. I didn't want to get a solar one yeah because it may not get a full charge okay but these yeah you take away um, electricity yeah and you run it right to the light right in the back here and it goes on the wall and these spin around yeah this spin around oh it spins oh look yeah 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 yeah. like so it can detect manual manual oh manual yeah, okay you, okay you can, if you want to go okay more that way yeah you can more that way yeah up down yeah. wow yeah and like i said yeah you can monitor it on your phone all times all day every day i'll go and study study it so just gotta push it in there yeah i can let me put it in a smaller box so okay a lighter box you know i was thinking like uh okay let's see what am i you missing do. a oh right here okay so these here yeah i can trash these okay Okay, we're gonna we're gonna yeah we're gonna put them somewhere. Oh man, we did business right here in the parking lot. Yeah. So let me bring my bag and see what can fit. Uh, let me see. Uh, no, that is the bag we need. Guys, we came to a store. Stefan brought me here because we want to buy this bag and this bag will help me carry stuff so we are another store here this is store number two because right now we are en route Africa no not the shop okay en route Africa mm -hmm. Oh, actually, they say the price here $17. Man, this guy has done a lot of stuff. I, I even don't know what to say. Oh my god, I'm just even stretching myself. But, uh, how do you say tap in Spanish? This is a phone lock. Yeah, this is Bajawada. 
Is it Pono? Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, Pono. yeah. <laughs> I think she, she looked at me, started laughing. Again, now she realized, wait, it was an honest question. This guy just asked. And oh, guys, we asked her how to say tap in tap Spanish. Tap in the card. Yeah, tap the card. And he said, Ponlo. He said, Pono? No, Ponlo. <laughs> Ponlo. Okay. You, right? okay yeah that's crazy man but one thing you have to know is uh anything social like that people like people like that type of vibe you know <laughs> of, of uh we can stretch it you know there's some bags that if you open right yeah Oh, Snoop, if huh? you want to put a tennis racket or something and make it longer. Yeah, 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 that's what I'm trying. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah. let's park before it rains now. Guys, this is Mara parking for Africa, en route Africa. And I'm telling you, this guy is another... Uh, people say animal in a good way anyway. Oh, it's 6. We have a meeting. What time is it? 7.40. Oh, this is how it looks like. I want to get a thumbnail, man. Big surprise. Guys, this is my brother. He surprised me from the airport up to now. I don't know how long this video is going to be. But this is my first day in America. You guys have seen the journey. And now I'm parking purely for Africa. Man, tell people to subscribe to your channel one more time. And hey guys. it's not that today. He's been supporting me all through, guys. And I said I have to meet him before I go to Africa. This is Stefan. Yes. I am Stefan. This is my yes. YouTube channel. Thank you, man. Please brother. go ahead and subscribe. Please go, man. If you love Marwa and he's coming to the party, you know? Absolutely. Oh, man. He bought me cameras. Look, I'm packing all these cameras. Security. Okay. Maybe we pack and we show you what you're talking about. So. So this is your, your battery. Yeah. Let's actually put. I put clothes first, then we put them on top. Okay, just drop them in there. Yeah, then I, when I'm in the house, I'll, I'll take time and arrange. So let's put in the cameras facing down. Yeah. Just to protect the screens. Yes. So all the cameras will fit in here. Eh? Now we are doing good. Yes. And the other one is here. Wow. So you plug them to electricity, you're done. Yeah, that's it. Wow. All right, let's, we got these here. Yeah. And this is a screw? Yeah. I screw. think they will not have a problem with the screw, right? No, they won't have a problem with the screw. Okay, yeah. I have a problem. Oh, there you go. There's three of them. Okay. And batteries. Yeah, we good. Yeah. You see, we got a really good bag. Then we put more clothes. Mm -hmm. to protect the cameras from bouncing uh, these small ones i can put them like, because I'll, I'll i'll use this one when i'm i'm dealing yeah just like that yeah 100 percent yeah wow bro <laughs> look where we are in a parking lot <laughs> uh, this is my guy you know I don't like to complicate stuff, bro. You know, I like it. I like it when we. Flow. So this bag, this bag can hold more. Yeah. So we got some more clothes there. Yeah, I'll put, I'll put it here. Yeah, because. But I don't want to overdo this bag. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. Actually, we can take even like this because this bag, like this. Yeah, we need just. Oh need man, we need a little more. No, this is a suit, so oh. it's gonna, it's gonna. So let's take the soft ones, soft clothes like this side. Alright, so actually we just Yeah. American Airlines will not say anything man. Nah. And to Nairobi I have uh let's take it slow. Oh it's on the outside. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Wow ah uh, man. Nyabohanse one, one way. <laughs> End route Nyabohanse. Yeah. Uh-huh. Ah, mm -hmm. uh, man. Actually, even it's easy to move with. Look. Yeah. Wow. Go put it on the ground. Yeah. 
Look at so that. if you open up that other bag yeah so let's let's fix this now look how crazy the car this car you see the water and this is her car she's going to pick her car over there but she's super lucky because she parked at the lane she can jump will you manage will you manage or we put a stone okay what you want no you could on the other side yeah you wanna go back? Ah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my God! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> she ended up stepping on it. Oh man! You know she ended up stepping in into the water like. Oh, we can't help at this point. I'm sorry, ma'am. Yeah, the bag is ready. Ready to go. Yeah, let me see. I, I didn't drop my slippers here. Oh, there are these screws. So you remove the screws? I remove these. Oh. The screws are still in there. Oh, I see. These yeah. are the... Okay, You yeah. really don't need those screws. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it's coming out of the wall, you can have two. Yeah. And you can have a nut on there. Oh, no, I see, I see. This is... Okay, this is... You know, you can't travel with these guys. So, that's why we are leaving them behind. Okay. Man, man, this is super special, bro. Oh, what happened? It, it's not full. Oh, if it detects anything, I think it's this one. I think it's this one. Yeah, yeah we can we can put it somewhere. <laughs> ah. Okay, all right. Okay, hey, this guy is a real command. <laughs> Life in America. Uh, America has never stopped surprising me, guys. I hear you. 100%. And, and it's starting to rain again. Okay, let's go then. Man, now I have to go and build so seriously because I know I have visitors coming, man, from America. Yeah, you got a lot of work to do, bro. I swear, man. I swear. I'm gonna hit this kombucha. Okay. They're gonna give me fuel to get home. Kombucha. Guys, I'm gonna be ending this video when I arrive at the hotel, Hilton Hotel, where he actually paid for me to stay there. So I'll show you my room and I'll be ending the video. But for now, we are driving home or we are driving there. You know, everywhere I go, man, I call places home, but it's not my home, you know? Oh, I wanted to show you. Yeah. This is my... Um... Oh, the GoPro you're talking about? Yeah. No, I know the reason. Just take everything out and leave it like this. You see, this is the sound right here. I'm showing him how to use this GoPro. Take, I swear, all these things and just leave the GoPro itself okay. and you'll be so surprised how it's it's very good. And this is my... Um, gimbal? Oh, oh yeah. battery yeah. charger. So yes. you, you have the same one, yes. but you just have the 11. Yeah. Mm. This way. Hey man, you're full swing. Those are real commando vibes. I, I later I'll get I'll get a memory card because I realize also GoPros they get they hit quick. Yeah. But if you had tell me that. Yeah. But don't worry. I'll, I'll walk. Up. Man, you've done too much for me, bro. You know, even now I'm feeling a little ashamed. You know, <laughs> not even a little. I am ashamed. Let's say it. Another Tesla behind us. Mm -hmm. Guys, we are finally here. I know you can't see me, but I'm gonna get out of the car. We're in Hilton. My brother booked me a night here, and I don't even want to ask the price. <laughs> but I, I don't know if you should be okay to say it, man. But it's. Uh, it's not. It's a little over 100. Okay. Wow, man. So I'm gonna be staying here tonight. There is Hilton in Kenya, bro. So all these things you're doing to me, I don't know if I'll manage when you arrive, bro. Ah, but I'll try my best. I'll try to find you the best Airbnb no, I know in Nairobi. It's all good. Oh man. And man, if you're coming to Kenya, uh, no, we, we have the we have the food. Yeah. Yeah. No, uh, going up I'll go. I just need to pick the food. 
can put it there. I don't know if we put the uh, this food I'm looking for. I have to pack my food, so don't worry if it's at the one, the one on the floor is mine. Oh, that one. That's the food. The okay. Rest is yours. Okay, my brother. Oh man, that rain is coming down. Yeah, man. I don't even know how to say thank you, man. I don't even know how to say thank you. You got your phone? Yeah, I have my phone. And yeah, we are good. Man, God bless you, man, a million times. Sir. I'll give you a hug. Good news, brother. All right, thank I'll, you. I'll, I'll let you know when I reach home. When you're home, you write me, okay? Yeah. Maybe I'll be dead asleep, but tomorrow I'll call yeah, you. Yeah, deserve it. All right. Yeah. Okay. Guys, look at this. Ah, uh, my friend, where did he put my bags? Uh, I think he took them inside. Okay. Yeah. Oh, it's right there. Right there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you. Enjoy. Thank you, bro. Guys, I'm in the Hilton here. I have some foods. I'm carrying my bags. I'm in Miami. And one of my subscribers now, my good friend, did a crazy shopping surprise bags, cameras, batteries, and I don't even know how to say it. We just even bought this bag today. Now, this is my new me. We have that. I'll have to put the tag. I'll have to get the tags later. I need to get my card. Okay. So now we go to the rooms. We are in Hilton. I think these are the elevators here. Let me see. Okay, Maro arrives in America. What a big surprise, man. These are all foods. I'm going to the sixth floor. Oh my God, you know? I hope it's picked sixth, man. Okay, okay, it's right here. You know, sometimes you have to tap. Oh my God. I don't know if I should tap this. Guys, look here, 610. Okay. Mara arrives in style. I can't even walk, guys. Too many stuff. <gasps> okay. Mm. Welcome to Hilton, room 6, 10, I, a friend and a brother now just booked this for me here, so I don't even know how to say bro, this has been my craziest day in America, first day I arrived here and a friend of mine who has been supporting me you guys know him you've been seeing his donations here on on the chat on my live stream his name is uh, stefan and stefan we talked we've been talking actually for months now and he had said marwa i want to take you to my island he's he's from here united states but his original home is angula angula I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong, but it's an island. So he told me, Mara, we should meet because he's leaving in two days. Actually, tomorrow is his last day here. 
before he heads to Angola because he has a business there. He told me, Maro, I want to treat you before you go and I want to meet you because he's been supporting me a lot. You know, sometimes when you guys donate to my channel, I actually can know your name and remember you. You know? That being said, is today he decided to treat me the way you've seen the video. He's bought me even CCTV cameras, batteries for my GoPro that I use to film. He bought me food. Look at these foods, guys. A lot of food, not... I'm alone, water. He bought me this new bag and nearly everything inside he bought he also paid for this hotel room for me what can i say man what a big surprise this could be the biggest surprise i've ever received in america i people do me a lot of favors i i i know but actually when he came and picked me at the airport like he has done a lot that even i can't remember bro Whew, what a day from Jamaica to Miami and me having this surprise bro if you're watching this God bless you thank you so much for your kind heart we talked a lot at least I know I know you now at the same time I wanna say guys please go subscribe to his YouTube channel he has a channel here just go say thank you for treating Mara right subscribe as much as you can I don't wanna say 1000 let's even get him 10,000 like like just share that love from deep down my soul. I want to ask you to go and support him. He has a YouTube channel and he has a business. He, he brought even me t-shirts. I'm forgetting even things he has done for me in just one single day. And ask myself, when he comes to my village, what will I do, bro? That's why I need to go back to Africa and build. But for now, let's enjoy America for a very short while before we hit the skies to Africa. Are you ready for this adventure? Subscribe and again, welcome to United States of America. Welcome to Hilton Hotel. Welcome to Miami. This is Miami. You see, people relax. These are the buildings. Actually, this is where we are. Miami, 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 Miami. Other people say Miami. I say Miami. Look outside. Can you see that? Wow. Can you actually even open this? Hilton. Can somebody open a window in Hilton? Oh. Uh oh. You can actually open, but a little bit. It's raining outside like crazy. All right, let me close this. Okay, beautiful space. All right guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Before you leave, go down here and say thank you to Stephen for supporting your boy. You know, man, when Mara is happy, you're happy. You get good videos, you get entertainment. And also you don't see your travel commando, man, suffer, suffering around the street, bro. And also it's good to have also rich friends. Nobody wants, nobody wants a sad life. And I'm so blessed to have people who actually support me beyond even what I can say, beyond even my own words, beyond my expression. That's the end of the video and welcome to United States. Welcome to Miami and see you on my next video. Okay, bye. Let me see. It's, the video is over guys, the video is over. I'm just getting my stuff out. The video is over guys, the video is over. The video is over. Maybe I'll have this one for the night. This was like four and a half dollars. Crazy bro. He told me I shouldn't drink this. I should drink it later. And then I got some fruits and tomorrow I'm gonna be meeting my friend Sobe King, the real boss. He calls himself South Beach King. Okay, these are bananas, I'll leave them there. The video is over guys. I'm just waiting you to subscribe if you haven't. This one I'll have to eat it right now because it's gonna spoil. There's more apple here. More water. Hey bro, this guy just spoiled me too much. 
all right the video is over have you subscribed that's the real question have you shared the video have you liked hmm? hilton hotel miami big surprise all i need is you baby baby Griffith Observatory in Los Angeles. So I'm officially saying goodbye to Japan. As you see, sir, welcome to Japan. Where is Elisa? Soy de España. I'm heading to.